In this time, I am crocheting the simple leaf made of variegated yarn. While making this leaf, you will learn how to work with front and back loops. This is front side of the leaf. And let's take a look at the back side. Such leaf can be used as an, an embellishment or as part Irish or Gipur laces. For work you need a ball of yarn and a crochet hook. Begin the work by making a chain of 16. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and sixteen. The foundation chain is ready. Then chain three for the pico. Insert the hook into the fourth chain stitch away from the hook by working with slip stitch. The pico is ready. Then chain. We'll skip one, two, and the third one. And make double crochet into the fourth chain stitch. In total, it should be four of them. Make two, three, and four. Then two half double crochet in a row. One, two. Make single crochet stitches till the end of the foundation chain. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, two more as a work, make a chain, we'll skip the next stitch. Make single crochet into the back loop. Make single crochet into the back loops. Continue the work, turn the work, make chain of five, one, two, three, four, five. Then chain of three for the pico, insert the hook into the fourth chain stitch by working a slip stitch. Make a chain, yarn over the hook, we'll skip one, two, three, 
and work into the fourth one, make double crochet and three double crochet more in a row. and four make double crochet into the back loop of the next stitch then two half double crochet one Two. Make single crochet stitches seven times in a row. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. I have done all stitches into the back loops. We have three stitches or three loops and the chain. We turn the work, chain, we skip the chain stitch. Make single crochet stitches into the back loops. Turn the work. Make a chain of five, one, two, three, four, five. Then chain of three for the pico. Work a slip stitch into the forest chain stitch away from the hook. Chain. Make four double crochet in a row. We we'll skip one, two, three, and work into the forest chain stitch. One, two, three, and the fourth one make into the back loop. Make two half double crochet. And six single crochet in a row. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have three last stitches and the chain. Turn the work, make a chain, work from the second loop, make single crochet in a row, make single crochet stitches, Turn the work, then chain of six, one, two, three, four, five, six, then chain of three for the pico and slip stitch into the fourth chain stitch. We 
we skip one, two, three, work into the fourth one, make double crochet into the stitch, make five double crochet in row two, three, four, and five. Make this stitch into the back loop. Make two half double crochet in a row. One, two, make five single crochet. One, two, three, four. Five. We have three last stitches and the chain stitch. Make a chain. Chain and single crochet from the second stitch. And single crochet into the each back loop. Well done. Two rounds of work. Then chain of six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then chain three for the beacon. And work a slip stitch into the fourth chain stitch away from the hook. Chain. Yarn over the hook. We skip one, two, three. Make double crochet into this stitch. In total, it should be five double crochet stitches. Two, three, four. And the fifth one into the back loop of the next stitch. Make two half double crochet. One. And two into the back loop. Let's stop and look what we have. This is the one half of the leaf. Then I'm going to work with the skip it stitches. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, the ninth one into the chain stitch, I will work with these stitches, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 
In total it should be 22 single crochet stitches. One half is ready. Now turn the work. Make a chain. We skip the next stitch. Work with the back loops. Single crochet. You should make single crochet stitches except the last four or three stitches. We are working with back loops. Let's count one, two, three, four. Then chain of two, one, two. Then chain of three for the pico. Work a slip stitch into the fourth chain stitch, then chain. Yarn over the hook. Insert the hook into the back loop by working double crochet. Make five double crochet in a row. In total it should be five of them. Two. Three. Four. Work with back loops. And five. Two half double crochet. One. Two. Make five single crochet. One. Two, three, four, five, then two rounds of work, chain, we skip stitch and single crochet into the next back loop. We'll leave last four stitches. Make single crochet into the each back loop. One, two, three, four. Turn the work. Chain of two. Then chain of three for the pico one, two, three, and slip stitch into the fourth chain stitch away from the hook. Chain. Make four double crochet in a row. One, work with back loops. Two. Three and four. Then 
then two half double crochet one two then six single crochet one two This is the third one, four, fifth one, six, turn the work, make a chain, we'll skip the next stitch and single crochet into the next back loop. Make single crochet stitches except three last back loops. Let's look one, two, three. Make single crochet, turn the work chain of two then chain of three for the pico and slip stitch into the forest chain stitch away from the hook chain and double crochet into the back loop total should be four of them two three and four then two half double crochet one and two then I'm going to make single crochet stitches seven times in a row one two three into the chain stitch work with the back loops four five six and seven Then we turn as a work, make a chain, work from the second loop, make single crochet stitches in a row. I leave three stitches or three back loops. Let's look one, two, three. Here what we have. Two rows of work. Then chain of two. Chain three for the pico and work a slip stitch into two loops. Make double crochet into the back loop. And make three more into the back loops two three and four in total should be four of them then two half double crochet one two Then I'm going to make single crochet stitches into the back loops one, two, three, four, 
three, four, five, six, seven, two rows of work. Make a chain. We skip the next stitch and work with back loops. Make single crochet into the each back loop. You should leave three back loops or stitches. Two rows of work, make a chain of two, then chain of three for the pico one, two, three, work a slip stitch into the fourth chain stitch away from the hood, then chain and four double crochet into the back loops, two, three, and four. Now continue two half double crochet one two. Then make single crochet stitches one two three four. Five and the six one into the chain stitch. Here, what we have let's stop. You can Cut off the yarn at this point and the leaf is ready. Make a slip stitch into the chain stitch if you want. The beautiful leaf is ready. This is front side. And let's take a look at the back side. As you can see, this is double sided leaf. Russell Boutique is the unique, stylish, handmade clothing studio of Elena Rugel. Together with purchasing ready clothes, you can also order any model you like at the boutique to be made special for you. Thanks for watching!